Good morning, hot dog eating fans. I'm Kevin Ripa, and this is My Sans 3 Minutes Max. For the next uh, few videos that we're going to do, uh, I want to talk about lies that your computer tells you. Uh, we've touched on this in some previous episodes in various uh, different ways, but I want to go more in depth with this. Now, this is uh, very, very important when it comes to digital forensics because often uh, we're faced with finding artifacts that will you know, help a case or, or uh, help further an internal investigation or incident response or something like that. And so we have to be able to trust what we see. Now, Microsoft has decided that there are files and folders on the computer that you, know, you just simply can't be trusted with. You shouldn't be allowed to access them uh, because they're system files. And when you start mucking around with system files, you may destroy the system. So Microsoft has uh, this function that allows them to hide these files and folders from you. Now, even if you figure out how to do this, how to, how to show them, and you can, uh, there's a second set of files and folders called system files and folders that Microsoft still uh, doesn't allow you to see. So you have to go find that setting as well, and you have to tell the computer that you want that setting enabled. Once that setting is enabled, well, you think you're out of settings. You think that I'm seeing everything that I can see. Well, <laughs> that is not true. And uh, for, like I say, for the next few episodes, we're going to see examples of this. Um, expanding on this, we're also going to see some of the uh, uh, bonuses and some of the shortcomings of a couple of different pieces of software that we use to take evidence files and mount them as drive letters. And we're going to show some of the shortcomings and some of the bonuses of a couple of different ones to, to show you uh, why you may or may not want to use one or the other tool to help further your investigation. So we're going to be covering uh, things like folders full of files that the computer is telling you do not exist. Uh, the folder is empty, and then we're going to show you that the folder is not empty. We're going to show you other, folder, other directories where there should be subdirectories, but there's not. But there is. But there's not. And these pitfalls all lead you to make incorrect assumptions, and certainly we've seen them in a number of investigations. Well, that's going to cover off the next four or five uh, episodes of Three Minutes Max. So, in the meantime, and in between time, that's it. Another episode of Three Minutes Max.